forehand, just like the backhand, has three key components. Um, the first being the grip of how you're holding onto the, uh, the frisbee. The second is the arm motion, actually how you're going to move and get power on the disc. And the third is your lower body. The last step in really getting that extra 10 to 15 yards on a hucking a flick or just getting a good solid uh, flick off. So the easiest way to grip for a forehand is just to make a gun with your hand, okay? Hold the disc in your left hand here. You're going to put your two fingers out together. And you're going to put the, your middle finger right on the rim, okay? It's going right there and then your index finger is going right on the other side. Then your thumb's going to go on top and it should be on the ring. You shouldn't want to have it cocked way back here. It shouldn't be here. You want to put it right on the ring, somewhere where it feels kind of comfortable in your hand. The other thing is the last two fingers, you don't want to leave it like that, okay? This finger and this finger need to extend to where you're creating four fingers across the middle, across, and you're pushing together on the inside here, you're pushing together on the inside here. First thing you need to do is you need to position yourself in a way that makes it, you can either go up line or you can go around, okay? So what's going to happen is some people, if you position yourself too far upfield, the defense doesn't respect the up the line cut, and it's going to be really hard for you to get the around. 